What's going on ladies and gents, boys and girls, guardians of all ages, Joker back again, once again, and boy oh fucking boy, would you just look at the time. It's time for another tantalizing episode of Bungie, hotline to the community, dot dot dot, again. Look into my shiny black visor and imagine my surprise. In the weekly update, Deej had this to say about the super special awesome Bungie Summit to bring together the greatest minds of the Destiny community to finally fix Destiny 2. Deej states, We've invited cooperative raiders, competitive warriors, lore lovers, and a high school principal to make sure they all get along. Oh fucking really now? You invited the lore community out. Okay. I'll bite. Who? No, really, who? Bife? Bife's not going. Mainland Games isn't going. I'm sure as hell not going. Hold on, let me check my inbox. Yep, no, I'm not going. And the last time I checked, if you YouTube search Destiny Lore, the first three recommended channels are... My name is Bife. Mainland Games. And of course, ladies and gents, boys and girls, guardians of all ages, yours truly, the one, the only, the wickedest joker in all the land, Dark Side Royalty Lore. But okay, you know what? I could see where Bungie might want to get a newer perspective. Maybe, maybe a smaller channel. Bife and Malin have already been out to several different events and they've given their opinion on the state of the game and I'm so blacklisted, I don't even think I'm allowed to step foot in Bellevue, Washington. So, hmm, let's see. Perhaps we can think of a smaller YouTube channel a lore enthusiast, maybe, maybe somebody like, I don't know, Bearded Grizzly? Oh, oh wait, no, he wasn't invited either. But you know what? That's fine. We're just YouTubers. If it wasn't for the likes of, say, Ishtar Collective, cataloging and recanting the lore to you would be very difficult. So maybe they got the invite. I mean, they do provide an integral service to the community. Oh, oh wait, imagine my surprise. They're not going either. Okay, well, maybe the OG lore master, Sir Wallen? No? Fire Focus Chat? No? Ghost Stories? No? Handsome Dragon? No? Terra Manus? No? Any member from the Destiny lore subreddit? No? So, if I'm not going, if Bife's not going, if Malin's not going, if Grizzly's not going, if Terra Manus isn't going, if Ishtar's not going, if Focus Fire Chat's not going, if Ghost Stories isn't going, if no one from the Destiny Lore subreddit is going, then who exactly from the Lore Lovers community is representing the Lore Lovers community again? Well, Deej, you got some splaining to do, old buddy, old pal, old friend of mine. Maybe, maybe, just maybe, you could help me understand. Clear this up a bit for me. Perhaps I'm a bit understandably dumbfounded because when you say things like Lore Lovers, I expect, well... Lore lovers, you see, from where I'm standing, this looks kinda bad. It kinda looks like you merely listed a bunch of Destiny sub-communities, said that they were represented in the hopes of winning over the Destiny community as a whole. It kinda looks like you flew the lore community banner, but left the lore community out in the cold to sit and spin entirely out of the discussion. It looks like Bungie is back again, once again, lying to their community, dot dot fucking dot again. Now, I already know what the PR spin on this is going to be. We left a lot of people off the list. There was no way we could invite everyone we wanted to hear from. Really? Really? Okay, so let me make sure I have this straight. Space is so limited that you couldn't invite any one of the prominent members of the Destiny lore community to represent the Destiny lore community during your summit to fix Destiny? More so, when lore and story have been a huge point of contention for the lifespan of Destiny 2, more so with the abysmal offerings on display with the Curse of Osiris. And you couldn't be bothered to call one lore master? Not one person? Oh, but you could say you did. Because saying and doing are the same thing, right? You could say you invited lore lovers, doesn't mean you actually had to because it's all relative, right? What a joke. Look, I don't care whose ass you fly out there. 
I don't care if it's mine, I don't care if it's Bifes, I don't care if it's Malin Games, or Bearded Grizzly, or Ishtar Commander, or Terra Mantis. What I do care about is, if you say that the lore community is being represented, you represent the lore community. Gasp! Shock! Surprise! It's almost like I expect you to do the bare fucking minimum! Look, Bungie, the lore community is not a box you can just tick off to try and trick people that the quality of your product has been assured. Because at the end of the day, that comes back on the lore community. It comes back on our reputations as leaders of the lore community. When people say, oh, but Bungie had this super awesome special summit, and they invited lore community members out, and yet the lore's not fixed, so our leaders must be hapless shills who don't care. When in reality, the community was never represented at all. Bungie just blatantly lied or misrepresented the facts. Again. But hey, fuck it. Those are just my thoughts. Let me know yours in the comments below. And like always, stay frosty.